Hey everyone, it's your girl Karen. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about my product empties. So let's just get into it. Um, I don't really have that many things to share with you guys, but you do have your staples and you do have the things that you regularly enjoy using. So especially for me, that's usually when I actually end up using all my products. Anywho, so let's just get on with the video. So the first product I want to talk about is this foundation. And it is the Oxygenating Foundation from Oxygenetic. So that's what this looks like. I have two different colors. This one is in beige, this one is in cream. I am usually the color cream during the winter time. But I'm getting a little bit tanner. I've been kind of walking outside. Don't worry, I'm practicing social distancing and anytime I walk out, no one's outside. <laughs> so just letting you know. Um, I, it's not like I'm just trying to socialize or anything. I'm just, you know, going on my routine walks, just trying to stay healthy, you know, trying to keep my, my heart healthy and happy. I am usually the color, I am the color cream during the winter time, but I am the color beige during like the warmer seasons, but then when it gets really warm, I probably won't actually be able to use this color anymore. But anyways, I finished these two bottles. I really, really like these products. They're very lightweight. They're moisturizing, which I appreciate, especially during the winter time because I struggle with dry patches and just like dry skin. So these are great, great, great for that. I think what really helps with this formula is that it has aloe gel in it and I think that's what really helps like soothe my skin because I could get very irritated skin sometimes whenever I do I like to use this one because it doesn't irritate dry out or anything um, it doesn't do any of that to my skin so I really appreciate that so these products or this product in particular I would highly recommend and I did repurchase it and I'm actually using it right now. I'll talk about double cleansing, I guess. So first product will be the actual um, oil. So I first start off with oil when I double cleanse. This is from DHC and it's their deep cleansing oil. It's actually very, very famous and very popular. A lot of people know about this. I really like this. And what I like about this is that it is more on the affordable range for an oil cleanser because I know some cleansers can go up to like 50 to like even a hundred dollars and I was like dang that is a lot of money for something that will remove your makeup so um no shade you know if you want to spend that much money because you have that kind of money I totally like you do you but you know if you don't really want to overspend um because you have more of a budget I highly suggest you guys try this one out I'm sure you guys have heard of this before but if you haven't like I said, I suggest you guys try this out. I actually um, got myself a backup of this because I am using a oil cleanser right now and it was like $45 and it's like some like organics company. I forget what it's called, but um, I don't like it as much as I like this because I like how this one it has like a thin consistency to it. So it's just easier to remove my makeup. Whereas the one that I'm using right now, the oil is a lot thicker. So it just feels like I'm tugging on my face a lot more. And obviously, if you guys don't know this, it's not good to tug on your face. You are damaging your face by tugging on your face, um, causing wrinkles, premature wrinkles. It's just not cute, guys, all right? So let's not tug on our face, let's be nice. Gravity is already not doing us that many favors, okay? <laughs> so what I would use with this on a typical day is I'd first go in with this and then I go in with this. And it is the Matcha Hemp Hydrating Cleanser by Crave Beauty. If you guys don't know, Crave Beauty is actually founded by Leah Yu. She's also a fellow YouTuber, if you guys don't know. Love her, love her content. She has great information. And um, I just really like her stuff, basically. I've tried a lot of her things. I think I only haven't tried only one or two of her products, but I've tried um, all the other ones. And they're really good stuff, honestly. I like her stuff. But I especially, my absolute favorite product from her is this matcha hemp hydrating cleanser. And I wish I could show you guys what it's like, but what I like about this is that the ingredient list is very short. You guys can't see it here, but the ingredient list is really short. It's just simple. All it does is it washes off the rest of your residue that didn't come off from the oil cleansing and it just strips not everything, it strips whatever is necessary 
but it doesn't strip your whole skin dry. And I cannot stand dry skin. I hate that squeak, like clean feeling. I just feel like my skin is like breaking into pieces when it happens. I cannot stand some cleansers. And this one though is like amazing. Uh, I'm actually trying, I'm actually using a different cleanser right now. I will repurchase this, probably, but I just wouldn't repurchase it just because I want to try other products. But, um, you know, if things don't work out and it's like, I need to go back to my OG number one, I'm gonna go back to this. So I will repurchase this eventually, it's just not right now. And yes, I highly do suggest this to anyone and everyone, all my friends. I literally did recommend this to like a lot of people in my life. I guess we're kind of more sticking to skincare. So next is the Bee Hydra Intensive Hydrating Serum. So this is what it looks like. It's like their little tester trial tube. I've had this empty for a while. I was just trying to collect some of my empties and I didn't really have that many so I couldn't you know, film an empties video. But I finally have a chance now so that's what I'm showing you guys. But this is my little empties product. Um, I liked it. It did quench my skin because um, it says quench and illuminate. I would say that it did quench my skin and it did illuminate, but it just wasn't so much to the point where I was like, this is a must have. So just because of that and Drunk Elephant in itself isn't the most affordable brand, at least for me right now. So I just don't like, I just didn't repurchase it because of that reason obviously though if you have the money like try this out you know like it, it's not a terrible product it's just i don't think it's worth the amount that it is at the moment for me if that makes sense skincare product again this one is a sun care item sun care and skincare in general is like one of my favorite things in the world and it's very important to take care of your skin, protect your skin. The best way for you to take care of your skin is by applying on SPF every day. So the one that I use is from Elta MD and it's their UV Elements Broad Spectrum SPF 44 and it's their moisturizing physical sunscreen. And what I like about this product is that it has hyaluronic acid in it. Um, and I also like that it has a tint because the skin color on my body is actually significantly darker than the shade on my face. So my <laughs> so it's actually good to have some pigment. So I really like the fact that it does add a little bit of pigment to my face, like especially during the summer. I don't want to wear makeup. I just quickly put this on, do my like fill in my brows and then like my mascara. And I'm pretty much good to go. Maybe some like light cream blush. But um, yeah, I highly suggest this product. I love it. And I love the fact that it also doesn't create any like white cast because with other sunscreen, when you apply it on, you could tell like it's like white, you know, it like whites out your face. So last but not least is a body care product. And this is the Cetaphil Moisturizing Lotion. And it's for the body and face, all skin types. It contains six moisturizers plus vitamins E and B5. Cool. Okay, what I really like about this, I actually don't apply this on my face. I only apply this all over my body. But I'm telling you, my skin feels so, so, so freaking moisturized after I apply this on. It's like, like it, I, I'm just like so quenched. Like my skin is so quenched after I apply this on. It's, 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 I know it sounds really funny, but it's true. I feel so great. Like my skin is just baby smooth. And even like when you kind of look at it, it kind of like, like glistens a little and it's like, dang, my skin looks juicy. Oh, it's glowing. Like, you know, like that's just the vibe and that's just like what this gives, you know, this is what it provides you. I never repurchased it because I just want to try other products, but there's no shade. I do like it. I would recommend it. However, um, I just want to try out other products.